This tutorial is for those of you that have Adobe Illustrator. If you don't know how to use Adobe Illustrator, that's okay. In this movie, you're going to get the training on two programs for the price of one. For this movie, we'll be using the Pasting Motion Project. You'll find the Chapter 12 folder. Now let's hop on over to Adobe Illustrator. When you first open Illustrator, you get this little welcome screen. Go ahead and create a new print document. Go ahead and click OK on the default settings. That's fine. We're actually not even going to worry about this document, so we don't have to save this or anything else. We're just going to create a shape and move along. So go over here to the Tools panel on the left-hand side and hold down the left mouse button under the Line Segment tool and select the Spiral tool. And just click and drag to create a spiral. Again, just like shape layers, we could hold the space bar to move the shape around while we're creating it, and then let go. Next, just to make sure we've got all the points selected, click the selection tool, the black arrow in the upper left-hand corner of the tools panel. You should see this blue bounding box around the object. And what we're going to do is we're going to copy this and paste it into After Effects as a motion path. Remember how earlier in this chapter we saw those little tiny dots on those motion paths that represented the frames and the big dots that we created with the pen tool represented the keyframes. Well, as you can see here in Illustrator, this path has several of those big points. When we paste this into After Effects, these points in Illustrator become keyframes in After Effects. So I'm going to hit Command C on the Mac or Control C on the PC to copy this shape. Then I'm going to go back to After Effects. Then I'm going to select the ghost layer and hit the letter P for position. And then I'm actually going to select the position property. This is hugely important. You have to select the position property. Selecting the layer is not good enough. You must select the position property and then paste by hitting Command V or Control V. And look at that. Instantaneously, all of these keyframes are created for you because of this motion path. And again, the anchor points in Illustrator have become the keyframes in After Effects automatically. So if I hit the home key and preview this, you can see that we have this cool toilet bowl animation created for us instantaneously by using Illustrator together with After Effects.